Hi, welcome back to Impossible 2.0. No, next up, I have Aries. So sorry, Aries, for your delayed video. I was spending time with my son. Also, I was on the spiritual attack. Okay, so I'm taking it one day at a time. Um, the time now is 1225. Okay, so it's um, 910. Wow, cycle's closing out a new cycle beginning for you. I'm so excited, Aries. Um, I did do your spiritual messages yesterday because a lot of people were like complaining like, oh, where's my spiritual message? <laughs> Stuff like that. Um, so if you guys don't know my first channel, I'm possible. I'm going to put it on my community board on this channel so you guys can follow me on my other channel as well. Please like, share, subscribe to that channel where I give you your angel messages and your old separate message. Okay, so let's begin <laughs> your reading. Um, Aries, I'm so excited. So let's see where spirit directs me right now. Let's see, let's see. Okay, let's start. You know what? Okay, I'm going to start with the truth is. Okay, so let's start with the truth is. All right. So I'm going to be switching it up here um, as well. Yes. All right. So let's start with the truth is. Let's go. Spirit, what do you have? What's coming out for Aries here? Spirit, letting go. So releasing. Okay, so you're releasing at this time. Releasing the relationship. Releasing people. Let them go with love and light, guys. That's what you have to do. Releasing anger, releasing pain. Yeah, so you're letting go. You're transforming as well with the butterflies. You may be seeing a lot of butterflies or have butterflies tattooed on you. Go out in nature more. Nature is very healing. So you're letting, even your children, you're releasing them, okay? But you're, you're letting go, all right, which is very good. Okay, victorious, overcoming. So I see you overcoming obstacles. So you may be overcoming obstacles with people in a connection, in your marriage, or there's somebody coming in, your support team. It doesn't have to, uh, it doesn't have to be a relationship, your support team. Some of you guys may like, like uh, rock climbing or marathons as well, but run your own race. You're running your own race, okay? So victorious, overcoming obstacles. Um, this is very, very good. So, you know, I see a partner coming in for you guys as well, and I see that you're going to be overcoming things together. Um, some of you guys are already in the limelight uh, with your soulmate already, and you guys are doing big things, bring it back, you know, it's like inspiring people. Yes, I see some type of inspirational speaker out there as well. One more. Yes, trust issues. Okay, so there may be some type of trust issues, but I see that you're going to be overcoming this. Or you dealt with, you know, you, you dealt with someone here, people, um, gaslighting you, love bombing you, okay, cheating, stuff like that. So you're overcoming this. Trust issues with others, trusting that others you know, being a little bit more vulnerable, but I do see there's a little bit of trust issues that you need to work on or somebody needs to work on in a relationship if you guys are in a relationship or with people, family, people. Okay, now this, I love me. There you go. You're putting yourself first. It's all about your self-worth, your self-care, taking care of yourself, okay? Teeth looking good, skin looking good, smelling good, right? Yes, okay? So you're not being valued in a connection. That's what spirit is saying. So I love me. Okay. And you know that victory. That's uh, some of you guys may be boxers out there or trainers or training. Uh, <laughs> but put yourself first. Okay. So you may be dealing with somebody here that has trust issues that was broken. You possibly always generate broken people. You're tired of broken people. Now you're putting your love into yourself. Okay. So you already know the manipulation before it gets to you or you, if you're in the connection, you already know you're dealing with a narcissist. It's time for me to remove myself out of this connection, let go and overcome my own obstacles. And God is going to send you the right people to do so. Support team, friends, or another companion. Okay. But you love, you put yourself first. That's what this is all about, okay? Love yourself first. Know your self-worth. Yes, that's very, very good. I love it. Okay, so, you know what? Hmm. I have, yeah, here we go. Cutlery. So some of you guys may be into in the restaurant business, culinary arts, going for some type of competition. I do I do see a dinner meeting or a food truck getting a vending license, something like this. But I see business meeting taking place here or a dinner. Somebody wants to take you to dinner here, or but restaurant business. Okay, some of you guys may you know work in hardware or silverware, something like this, or love to cook. Okay, chefs out there and teach others. Okay, so. Excuse me. Some of you guys may teach uh, teach people self care. 
or how to live an independent life, like in, in, in terms of cooking, cooking skills, and self-care skills. Something like this you're going to get into if you're not doing it already. How to dress, you know, how to, you know, hygiene, stuff like that, and how, uh, how to live independently. But I do see a meeting, a business, restaurant, food truck, vending license, something entrepreneur, but a date, a date coming. Business tools, needing more money, living well, okay? Career, food related, sole provider, and more work. So there's more work that's gonna be added uh, to your plate here. Some of you guys may be sous chefs, executive chefs, some type of top chef out there as well in the food business or you know a cookbook um yes creating your own cookbook how to eat healthier something like this but something having to do with food related but be careful with overindulgence as well okay but more work and sole provider so again what i was saying about independence so this is all about your independence you may have been the sole provider in a family you know stuff like that but now it's teaching others how to live independently and doing your own solo act here okay yes but you're going to be living well some guys need more money Money. okay you're needing more money so be careful with overspending okay but business tools you have the tools that you need okay so some of you guys are into business have degrees in business but it's all about taking care of business networking and getting down to business okay yes all right but I do see again like I said a dinner a dinner day or dinner coming something like this okay yes poor health so some of you guys are um, suffering from some type of insomnia headaches check your head guys some of you guys may be mental health professions psychologists out there not sleeping well at night but there's some type of addictive habits smoking drinking drugs something like this okay it could be money sex but there's some type of mental health conditions going on here okay some of you guys are neglecting your health so spirit is saying go to the doctor check your health okay yes Yes, my hot mess. Okay, so some of you guys are a hot mess out there or dealing with somebody that's a hot mess that's giving you a headache. You need to clean up the fucking act, Aries. Okay, smoking, drinking. Be, be, be careful with drunk calling people or somebody drunk calling you, but you may be dealing with this, a toxic environment here. Somebody driving you crazy here as well, and you're spiraling out of control. It's time to come back to the light. It's time to spray, uh, stay prayed up, guys. Okay? Yes. All right? So speaking about that, I'm going to get an angel for you as well. Okay, so there's a hot mess here. There's a disorderly habit. Somebody's untidy here, um, not cleansed, uh, not, not you know, um, how can I say, not clean. It's messy. It's messy, but this is a messy situation, chaotic. Okay, yes. Some of you guys may have a blue phone as well, smoke cigarettes. Single life. Okay, so I see that you're getting out of a, a relationship or you, some of you guys are just single, but dealing with messy people or around toxic people, you need to break free. Okay, but spirit doesn't want you to settle for a bad match. Okay, but some of you guys are removing yourself out of a toxic situation here where there's a codependency um, of some sort. Okay, but you're becoming more self-reliant. This is what it's all about. Okay, your independence. Some of you guys may have a short, uh, short blonde haircut. I see a lot of blue here. Try to wear blue this week. But blue is the representation of Archangel, Make, Arch, Archangel Michael and protection. Okay? Yes. Yeah, self-image in reverse. Okay, so starting to feel good about yourself. Okay? Starting to feel good about yourself. Um, some of you guys may be, may, have, may be recovering from cosmetic surgery, may have done cosmetic surgery. Um, but this is you not needing to, not feeling the need to change anything about yourself. You feel you're feeling good about yourself. You're you're fighting back insecurities, self doubt, stuff like that. Okay, but I see people masks are about to be removed here as well all right some of you guys are finishing up nursing school or you know uh, residency uh, some of you guys are surgeons out there as well but yes you, you don't you're not focused on self-image you but spirit wants you to focus on self-image because if you're a hot mess right now focus on the things that you could change within within not exterior within okay because there's a lot of deep repressed feelings here okay but work on yourself there you go work on yourself Yes, ow, there's some type of black magic in your energy, and I felt some kind of way about this as well. I told you, we're all under spiritual attack here. Yes, yeah, serendipity. Okay. 
somebody who's doing some type of shadow work here, follow your intuitions when it comes to your happiness. It's like some type of darkness clowning your happiness here. You don't understand what it is. It's like one minute you're high, one minute you're low. Something like this. But I see that you're overcoming it, and there's a new, there's some type of happy surprise on the horizon for you. But let's see what this magic is about. Somebody may be doing love magic as well, trying to call in their soulmate or, or a karmic soulmate, okay? But a fortunate, fortunate stroke of luck is on the way. Yes, pink diamond. This is valuing yourself, knowing your self-worth as well, okay? But there's a rare opportunity in love and business coming your way. Don't miss it. A one-of-a-kind love. But, you know, I see engagement as well and marriage. So some of you guys are already married out there. Yes, but there's a coldness surrounding you, like I said. It's like somebody's blocking your happiness here. You don't, you don't understand why your love life is blocked. But there's a coldness in the air when it comes to your happiness. This is what you see for your future. Getting married for some of you guys. You valuing yourself. You see happiness. But at the same time, why is this chaotic, hot mess, poor health? Yes, I'm single. I love myself. You know, I, I don't I don't feel the need to change anything because I, I do love myself. But there are certain things that you need to work on internally. Okay, that's for some of you guys. But there is some type of shadow surrounding this here. We're going to find out what this is. Okay, but there's deep emotions buried within that you need to release. Yes, I see a date. So there is a date coming. Okay, like I said. So being open to love. Being receptive, yes, but some of you guys are suffering financially, trying to clear up bad debt right now with that student loans, you know, have backed up in bills, rent, but finances, needing more money. Hold on. There may be some type of chaos surrounding you at this time as well, but you're trying to generate more income. This is what this is, okay? Yes. Good or bad financial changes are on the way. But somebody's, yes, there's a woman, significant woman coming in, man. But this is you being your empress, yin energy, okay? Loving yourself, not chasing anyone, standing in your power, okay? Knowing your self-worth. But there's a woman coming through, okay? Woman, man, this is unisex. Okay, so there's some type of good news coming around here. Some of you guys may work in a hair salon, have blonde hair, red lipstick. Okay, red, but passion being reignited here. But there's some form of good news coming in for you guys. Something has Someone has something to say to you. Be open to listen, be receptive. But I do see job interviews and a date, getting dressed up to go on a date here. Okay, this conversation is going to make you very happy, but you need to communicate more clearly. Yes, waiting. Okay, so there's a waiting game here, but there is messages coming from divine. So pay attention to the signs and synchronicities here, but there's blockages here. So some of you guys are just going on lunch by yourself. You're really secluded and isolated right now and overthinking the situation, which is driving you crazy here. But you're trying to come up with a solution in terms of your money, okay? Because some of you guys are already single out there, or some of you guys are not single in a toxic environment and trying to come up with some type of money, or trying to, or trying to find opportunities to get yourself out of this situation here. But Spirit is saying, don't put your life on hold waiting for someone or something, okay? But you're prepared. Expect to hear news. Yes, thorns. This is a prickly situation with you, a painful sacrifice. You feel like life is testing you at this time, trial and error. Yes, so some of you guys are giving up on projects. This came out before for you guys, okay? But Spirit wants you to explore all possibilities. Don't give up explore okay so tap into your full potential here okay you're gonna lose win some yeah there's a celebration coming up all right so this is you going out more lightning something's gonna be happening fast okay yes a soulmate is gonna come in and your abundance but right now there's changes needed to be made within internally okay Yes, but there's an upcoming event, a social event, and I see your, I see sudden wealth. Things are going to be happening rather quickly. Playfulness. This may be somebody younger or somebody that's lively. Yes, okay? And I see that you're going to be meeting someone here that's going to be your soulmate. But it's like socializing more, group events, going out more, or joining a group event. And yes, networking and your money coming through, okay? But let's see here. But somebody wants you to give up on your ideas and plans here as well they do they don't want they, they don't want you to see you they want to leave you like a hot mess here they don't want to see you do more or better than them isn't that always the case
Yes, I told you, pay attention to the signs and symbols. This may be a water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. You may be seeing a lot of feathers as well. Yes, behind the scenes. Things are happening behind the scenes. You may have been on the news as well, news reporters. Some of you guys are actors, actresses, filming for a new movie, directors, producers, writers, journalists, okay? But I see a job interview as well or promotion, okay? Yes, romantic thoughts. So somebody's having romantic thoughts about you, yeah? Somebody's working on something behind the scenes as well. This person may be in the entertainment industry, kicked out. Yes, yeah, so somebody's getting kicked out here. Somebody uh, may, you may be evicting someone or somebody, you know, or you're suffering from some type, from some type of eviction. But somebody may be getting kicked out of the house here. Okay, yes, there's blockages here. Somebody wants to cause blockages in your way. Like I said, obstacles. But you're going to be overcoming your obstacles. Remember that. Aries. So these are just tests. You feel like life is testing you. It is. But trial and error in reverse means that you're not put in, you're putting in your full potential. Don't give up on your ideas. Just because you feel like, oh, this is not going to work out for me. Spirit is saying, go. Run your own race. It doesn't matter who win here. At least you tried. Okay? Yes. In order for us to succeed, we must fail. Yes. Okay? But doesn't mean that you give up and just throw the whole thing away. No. You try again. Okay? Yes. It's just like cooking. Right? Cooking takes years and years of you don't do you don't necessarily need a culinary degree to know how to cook, right? It comes with years and years of experience doing something over and over to get it correctly. And sometimes even if you do it have been doing it for years, sometimes you're still gonna slip up every now and then, right? But that's okay. Doesn't mean that you don't know how to cook or you don't know your shit. It's just just means that today was just a bad day. Tomorrow's another day right so yes okay so you're gonna make mistakes every now and then but that's a learning lesson all right but doesn't mean that you just throw the whole project away or just throw up throw away your whole dreams no continue on okay yes continue on perfecting your craft no matter what people may think about it work in silence okay but let's go yes there's a fork in the road there's decisions this 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 <laughs> There's a fork in the road, indecisiveness here, okay? Needing to make a decision, don't know what to do here, confused, okay? Yes, you feel like there's no way out, but pray on it. The answers are coming. Pray on it. The answers are coming. Angel numbers. They're sending you angel numbers. 111, 222, 333, okay? Yes, pay attention. You may be seeing them in your dreams as well, okay? Ash, you may be seeing in the, in them in your dreams as well because you, you guys are having out-of-body experiences. So you may be dreaming a lot, prophetic dreams. They're trying to send you numbers. Look at those numbers, see what it means, okay? Yes, because you're about to upgrade, babes. You're about to upgrade, meant to be. Yes, so somebody's coming in that's meant to be, but caution. Be careful with people. Be careful with your surroundings. Pay attention to your surroundings. Follow your intuitions, your instincts. Okay, somebody may have passed away as well, tragically. My condolences, but be careful. Caution, caution. Okay? Yeah, somebody's trying to bind you here, but I see your life purpose. You're releasing, liberating yourself, and following your life purpose. And somebody that's coming in is going to be on the same page a soul connection okay but your life is about to upgrade it is all right so i wouldn't worry about it if i were you yes drastic okay so extreme harsh cutoffs for you some of you guys may drive a black car as well okay or work in a parking lot yes verge confession in reverse yes somebody's not revealing the truth here or somebody's scared to speak up here as well you're cutting that you're, you're giving people the silent treatment yes financial support so some of you guys are going to court here over some type of money whatever whatever this is this could be a divorce this could be property this could be a job or an accident of some sort but yes okay but there's some type of financial support need to be paid out here intervention so others are involved here, but I see divine intervention taking place here as well. Yes. Today. Okay. What I said, today is today, but every day is a new day to start over. So spirit wants you to be in the present and now focus. Okay. Yes. Although it may seem dull, mundane, gray, they're still, you're still growing. You're still growing. No matter, no matter what the obstacles are, you're still growing through this. This is about spiritual food. Okay, fast. Some of you guys need to fast. But you're growing through this phase, through this darkness. You're still growing. Okay? 
Yes, irreconcilable differences. Somebody's getting a divorce here or separation. Finalizing something here. Yes, unconditional love. Somebody has unconditional love for you. You may be meeting a divorcee um, as well, okay? But somebody is in love with you here. Or you're in love with someone. Yes, your divine is coming in, okay? But I saw a yin, yang is coming in. Yes, a twin flame for some of you guys on the table. And what I said, Archangel Michael is protecting this. But on the table, so somebody wants to confess here. I see a proposal of some sort. Somebody wants to go out for drinks. Somebody's coming in single, but you guys are single and all about business here. Okay, but there's a mirror energy going on here between you and someone. Journal, somebody wants to communicate with you here as well. Write you a message here. Trying to try to come up with the right words, but some of you guys are journalists, journalists out there. But write down your ideas, okay? But some of you guys have a journal, yes, okay. So you know, write down. Writing is very therapeutic. It's healing to to you. You can look back, read your notes, see what you wrote down, okay, as well, yes. Yes, confetti. There is a celebration. I see a promotion, retirement, wedding, birthday, promotion. Yeah, I said, but there's a cutthroat. Here we go. There's a heartless. Uh, <laughs> there's somebody here that's not too happy about, you know, your success. Because I see that you guys are going to be very successful out there. Um, yes. Um, so you have competition here, um, of course. Okay. So let's see here. Somebody, yeah, oblivion. These are people that's unawakened. All right. These are people that... Are living in the 3d okay gossiping fucking sucking but somebody wants to have a heart-to-heart -heart conversation with you here let's see what this is about so somebody wants to have a heart-to-heart -heart conversation with you um yes i see yes exchange somebody has a gift for you here but be careful with gift magic okay yes empress okay so yes so i see you guys are top notch top shit some of you guys are married children divorcees business owners self-employed uh yes bosses at work run your own company but taurus libra yes you guys are definitely empress somebody values you here somebody gonna see your worth and value and i see reciprocity coming in okay but you have a cutthroat you have a third party interference it could be friends family or another person involved in this situation okay Somebody is not too happy about your success. Who cares? Jealousy and envy is rotten to the core. Yes, you, what I said, three is a crowd. What I said, three is a crowd, babe. There's too many people interfering here, too many people up in the business. Yes, discovery, but you're discovering your hidden talents as well. Some of you guys may have been very talented since a child or your children are very talented, but you're going to be discovering some type of truth here about a third party or about people, okay? Yes, or about a person. But, yeah, but things come to light. Yes, but somebody has unconditional, unconditional love, again, for you, okay? Yes, but somebody's trying to block somebody out from you, okay? But I see somebody going through a divorce. What I said, communication is coming in. Somebody needs to talk to you here, okay? Yes, they're going to send you a message. So be prepared for a message here, guys, and dinner. Yes, the end, okay? But somebody doesn't want something to end, but it's coming to an end here. Um, yes, okay? So somebody, somebody here doesn't want you to cut them off. They don't want to end it between you and them, but somebody's ending something with a third party or you removed yourself from this third party. The end is the... This is the devil, okay, energy, uh, Capricorn. Oh, no, I said Capricorn, I meant Scorpio, okay? Yes, but somebody may have passed away, but the end. Something is coming to a complete end with these people. You're removing people out of your life, these toxic people, okay? Yes. Some of you guys may be bus drivers as well. Yes, envy, what I said. What I said, there's jealous and envious eyes surrounding you at this time. They're mad at you. All right, but inspiration. But you're going to be an inspiration to many. So these haters, they hate on you because you're talented and they're talentless. That's not your fault. Okay, but you guys are multi-talented. Some of you guys work in construction, some type of artist. Some of you guys are some type of artist out there, but I do see manifestation taking place here, relocation, building a new home, but house is representation of foundation. So this is about your stability, okay? Yes. Mm -hmm. I see somebody wanted to live with you as well. Yes, what I said, the support is coming in. 
your support team is coming in. Okay, yes. Somebody finds you to be insatiable. They want to they wanna kiss you um, as well. But a lot of people are going to be jealous and envious over your connection if they're not jealous and envious already. Okay, so let's see what's, what's going on here. And then I have to pick more cards. All right, what's this black magic about, spirit? The tower, Scorpio, is an upheaval, some type of trauma, tragedy, accident. But yes, somebody wants to cause chaos in your life. Yeah, six of swords. This person may live a distance as well, but I see you moving forward. Somebody wants to leave you stuck. Somebody doesn't want you to move forward here um, as well. Okay, somebody wants to block you from moving forward. So even if you try to move forward, you feel like there's blockages. Okay, yes. You're trying to get away from the bullshit here. Yes, nine of pentacles. Yes, some of you guys are single, abundant out there, not a care in the world. Your, your money is coming in. Uh, they want to slow up your money. They're jealous of you, how you take care of yourself, and how you don't need anybody company here. You're secured. and You're, you're secured in oneself. You're looking good. But there's somebody here that's jealous of your status here. But this is working towards your independence. They don't want, they don't want, <laughs> they don't want you to, they don't want your money to come in. Yes, you see, they don't want your money to come in. Somebody been paying into this for a very long time here as well, okay? Yes, but you guys are putting in the hard work, hard work, hard work, trying to build up to the Nine of Pentacles, but you just feel like there's delays when it comes to your money here. They want to slow up your money. Yes, the High Priestess. They went to a High Priestess to do this. Somebody's getting tower readings on you as well. Uh, yes, what I said, they've been paying into this for a very long time. Um, yeah, somebody's trying to block your intuitions as well. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Virgo. Yes, two of wands. Something hasn't, something hasn't been fully closed out yet, but somebody's not done with you yet. Somebody's looking all over your social media. Somebody may have went to a, uh, pay somebody online. Somebody may have been paying somebody online overseas to do this for a very long time. Okay, yes. But you just feel, some of you guys feel like you can't get ahead. Yes, nine of cups. Okay, so you may be drinking, smoking, overindulgent, drugs. Uh, somebody may be stubborn here as well. Okay, as well. Yeah. Uh, so if you're manifesting, be careful with food and drinks. Okay, yes. In terms of dreams or what people give you to eat. Yeah, but I see somebody here is overindulgent. So they want you to be addicted to something here. Yes, food alcohol smoking yes yeah three of cups these are these are a group of people doing this against you this could be family friends or people that you used to hang out with yeah they're doing this magic okay yes they want to block your success all right this could be over a child as well but they want to block your success yes page of cups these are people that kiss your ass or somebody that's younger than you uh yes but definitely they're sending intentions your way you're not sleeping well at night you're getting spiritually attacked here um, yes, yeah, somebody's speaking ill intentions over your life, but this is a group of people doing it together. Okay, hold on. Let's see what this heart to heart is about, and then I'm going to pick up on your divine because I still have to pick more messages for you guys. Okay, justice. This may be a Libra, but somebody wants to be fair with you here. Okay, somebody wants to get back together. They want to resolve things between you and them. All right, so let's see here. Yes, the strength. Okay, this person may be prideful. This may be a Leo. They're building up their strength to come in, to speak to you, to, to have this heart-to-heart. -heart. Um, yes, you tamed the beast in this person as well. Um, yeah. Yes, temperance. They want your forgiveness here, Sagittarius. This is a soulmate. They're being divinely guided. They feel like you're, you know, that you were divinely guided to the, towards them. Excuse me. Um, yes. They want to bring harmony and balance back into this connection here. Or friendship. Yes, the will of fortune. Destiny is at play here. They felt like they, you know, it was bad timing or, you know, uh, there was a lesson that needs to be learned here with you, but they feel like, you know, you come one in a lifetime here. So something is changing here. Somebody's changing their perspective here. Yes, page of, page of cups. They want to apologize here. This is somebody from your past, possibly 
uh, Queen of Pentacles, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. This could be a friend, family, mother-in-law, somebody that you know, okay? Somebody feels like you're their soulmate as well. Yes, Five of Swords. Some of you guys may have had an argument or a fight uh, with this person. Um, yes, or this could be your own child that you had an argument and fight with. Some type of violence took place here. Okay, yes, Nine of Swords. Okay, somebody's really up in their head about this. A lot of regrets here. There may be a mother figure involved in this situation. Yeah. Yes, Hangman. There's the ladies here. Somebody's overthinking this, really stressed out about what to say here. Uh, you release this as well. You may be thinking about this person because they're thinking about you. Yes, they're going to send you a message here, but there was some type of paperwork found out here or taken out here. But somebody wants to reignite something here. Uh-huh. Yeah, Six of Swords. Okay, this person may live a distance as well, but they want to move in towards you here. Yes. Yeah. I see blockages, somebody letting down their guard here. Somebody feels like you're their soulmate. They want to work on things with you. They feel like this soul connection, they want you to let down their guards. They're coming in vulnerable here. Um, yes, you 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 moved away from this person here. You kept your distance from this person. You found out something, some type of message, or this was all over some type of legal matters, over kids for some of you guys, or just legal matters. And um, yes, it's like trying to work it out with family, friends. Um, compromising here, finding balance, but there's a two of cups coming in. Okay, this person may live a distance. Yes, they're keeping their eye on you as well. Um, wherever this is, they're keeping their eye on you here. Divine masculine. Let me get three cards. Who is this divine masculine? Spirit, love, and light. The two of cups there you go there's the two of cups coming in <laughs> love harmony balance a proposal seven of cups okay you're gonna have to think about this you're gonna have to weigh out your options here or you may have a lot of options with this person treated you like an option here but there's a lot of repressed feelings fantasizing daydreaming here um yes longing for you if you know this person but yes, the high priestess, okay, with the high priestess here, there may be somebody manipulating this person's energy or your energy here, um, yes, but this is, a, this is a spiritual connection here, you can feel it, or this person could feel it, they're being divinely sent to you, guided, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Virgo, yes, this is a new love coming in for some of you guys as well, okay, yes, ooh, ten swords, somebody stabbed you on your back here. There may have been a pregnancy involved in this situation. Yes, temperance. Again, earth angel. Spiritual. This is spiritual. This is a spiritual soulmate here. Yes. And ten of pentacles. Somebody wants to settle down. Whoever this is has a lot of money here. Yes, somebody's manifesting this. Manifesting this new love. This is your good fortune coming back around. I see you guys are going to be doing well together. This person possibly have their own business. Again, an entrepreneur. Or you guys are entrepreneur. But I see long term relationship here. Moving together. Having children. Building a legacy together. Okay? Yes, this is what this person wants. Um, but they're, you're going to have to think about this. There may have been hidden factors here or yeah but follow your intuitions follow your intuitions but this is somebody being on this is somebody who has unconditional love if you know this person already but i see that they want to build their future with you okay they feel like that that you're the one will of fortune you're the one they missed their opportunity this may be somebody younger gemini virgo but they want to come in to communicate with you but i see you manifesting a new love and they're coming in okay yes Yes, this is about your independence. So I see that you guys are very independent, you guys. Again, with the blue. Blue is protection, so protective on oneself. Um, I see remaining incognito. Some of you guys may love to wear shades or briefcase. You carry a briefcase. But I see that you're very independent, bold, courageous. Or somebody's coming in independent. Yeah, some guys are some type of entertainer or entertainment industry as well. For um, promoters. I was going to say, porn. yeah, mistakes. So there was a lot of mistakes. What I said about mistakes, mistakes are learning lessons, okay? So, you know, accept responsibility and move on from that. 
let go and you will get through yes comfort is going to be restored in your life okay feeling good about yourself you're entering in a comfortable period upgrading yes be a sport but not everybody's on your team some of you guys may be coaches af um, athletes out there whatever that may be um but in the health and fitness um yeah into health and fitness but i see a collaboration but not everybody's on your team. Be a sport. Yes, because there's arguments possibly in a collaboration or in a marriage or family unit or friends. Yeah. Yes, but success will find you. Okay, so keep going. Very success will find you. Okay, but there's a little bit of riffraff. Prudence. Be careful with how you spend money as well. Okay, budget. Budget. Stop. Uh, yeah, counselors. Some of you guys are counselors out there. Psychic, um, healing work, or, you know, negotiators, work in the law. Uh, 46. Some of you guys may be 46 years old as well. But 10. I see, I saw a 46-year-old man. Okay, so 10. We started with 10. There's a new there's a new fruitful stage you're going to be entering in, but there's a lot of bullshit. There's bullshit that's going to be removed. Okay? Yes. But you're getting down to business. Success will find you. Okay? Just keep putting in your keep putting in that work. Yes, ninja. Move in silence. Okay? Yes. The master the master of stealth, shadow walker. <laughs> All right. But yeah, some of you guys are black uh, black belts, uh, martial artists, yes, bards. Some of you guys, um, somebody's gonna take you to a restaurant. Uh, where they want to serenade you or you guys sing in restaurants or yes, yeah, some type of let ballets. Okay. But yeah, Hunter in reverse. So spirit is saying, don't give up survivalists. You guys are survivalists, but some of you guys are giving up. Okay. You feel like, you know, you're at the end of the rope here. You can't survive on your own. I never heard of Aries not having a backbone here, but yeah, it's like giving up, giving up, you know? Yes, employee. Okay, so some of you guys are building your own consultation firm or law firm or open this up, uh, uh, opening it. But some of you guys may have may be the only female amongst men in your company. Okay, but I do see some type of worker service consultation firm, or you're seeking this. Okay, seeking some type of uh, legal advice here. Me and somebody to work as well. Yes, criminal. So some of you guys may have a criminal background as well or you know be dealing with somebody that's locked up or gang or um working work in this field okay yes somebody may be on parole as well yeah mother okay so there's a mother figure here um some of you guys are already mothers some of you guys have lost your child my condolences but yeah some of you guys are yearning for a child or your child is locked up at, the, at this time but mother yes community i see some so your support team coming in okay yes you maybe you know starting some type of um, neighborhood watch or you have something going on in your neighborhood or planning something but teaming up somebody wants to cooperate here people want to cooperate here i see you being some type of public figure public speaker uh justice something about justice fairness something like this okay yes but um turning around your community Okay, like making up, make uh, taking a stand, um, some type of activist, something that you're going to be doing here. Okay, yes, I can't put my finger on it, but let's continue. Let's continue here. Some of you guys work with children as well, doing something for the kids. Okay. Yeah, seduction. Be careful with this. Some of you guys may, li may love to do oral as well, but there's a third-party interference here, one-night stands, hookups going on here. Be careful with this. Yes, hammer. Okay, so somebody here wants to, somebody sabotage this connection between you and them. They want to rebuild it. They want to work on things, repair it. Again, victory, overcoming obstacles together or not. Some of you guys, there was some type of, again, uh, sleeping around going on here. Yes, not today. Some of you guys don't want to be bothered. And I'm having a hard time speaking here as well, guys. I hope you know that. But, you know, you're setting those healthy boundaries. You're hurt. Uh, you're avoiding conversation right now. You're still upset. Yes, yeah, separation. Yes, yeah, some of you guys are going through a separation. There's some type of sadness, bitterness here. Somebody's missing you here as well. One more. 
and teddy bear okay so yes somebody's interested in you here i see somebody wants to date you here there's going to be flirting going on here as well so be prepared for that be prepared for it Yeah, somebody's thinking about you, missing you, craving you, desiring you. Wow. Okay. Yeah, it's karma, but people are going through their own karma. I mean, consequences, cause and effect. They have to pay karmic debt here. So you may be wrapping up karma um, or somebody else, people. Heart fog, yes. Somebody was giving you mixed signals here. It's blocked emotions here, but shocking. Time, loyalty. So somebody's coming in loyal. Um, yes, but somebody's resisting here, resisting. You have a secret admirer here that's that's holding back right now. Okay, yeah. But the memory, some of you guys will, some of you guys may have been waiting for someone, okay, or waiting for your blessings to come in. It's, everything is happening in divine timing, but you guys were wasting a lot of time here with someone. Yeah, shocking, unexpected. Something happened unexpected, or somebody's going to shock you, take you by surprise, because somebody's loyal. Somebody's dedicated. Some of you guys have an animal that's, you know, that's, that's your friend. But there's somebody coming in loyal, trustworthy, and reliable, okay? That's going to take you by surprise. It's going to come out of nowhere, this person, okay? This is like, this energy is very heavy here. Very heavy. Let me sage. Hold on. Yes, Aries. Very heavy energy. You hear the ambulance outside? Police. Chaos. Let me sweep this out. Yeah, sorry guys. All right, let me clean up the space and continue. Okay, I just picked up, somebody's remaining loyal to you, even if you're not speaking to them, they're still loyal to you and dedicated to you. So there's somebody here that possibly betrayed you here. They know that they betrayed you, they're getting their own karma. They see you in a different light here and now their loyalty belongs to you. Some Something is happening here. Okay, where somebody here is seeing you in a different light and seeing people for who they are after they betrayed you. So their loyalty belongs to you. Something like this. Okay, so let's see what's going on else in your energy. And then I'm going to pull tarot. Yeah, see, there's some type of disruption. I can't make this up. There's a type of, some type of disruption, some type of binding. I was getting a headache. My head is feeling lighter now, guys. Okay. Yes, but somebody, this is a binding. Somebody wants to leave you stuck here. And this is what I was feeling here. It's a stuck energy, binding energy here. <sighs> New beginnings in reverse. What I said, somebody doesn't want you to move forward. It's like blockages here. You really, really, really need to cleanse your space here, uh, Aries. Okay? You really do. Okay? Yes, yeah, sacral chakra. Sacral chakra is all about healthier relationships. Um joy, creativity, expressing oneself, but be mindful. It's, it's, it could speak of seduction, sexuality, sensuality, intimacy. So be careful with who you give your body to at this time, okay? But it's like a healthier relationship is coming in, but you have unfinished business with someone or they have unfinished business with you. Somebody's trying to cause chaos in your life. Yes, that's the truth, but there's a truth coming out here. Balance, okay? Justice. Yes, balance. What I said, balance is going to be restored here. The magician, the ascendant masters are with you. Wrongs being made right at this time. Some type of truth coming out here. I see truth, love, finances, and fiery, passionate new beginnings and projects. But some type of victory coming your way here. The magician manifestation. Yes, come back to the light. Stay focused on the light, but you attract a lot of haters, spiritual haters. They attract to your light, but spirit wants you to come back to the light. Stay stay focused on spiritual things, not material things, not earthly things, spiritual things, okay? Some of you guys are light workers, yes, emotionally withdrawn, so that's how you feel. So meditate, stay prayed up, read your Bible, read uplifting books, spiritual books, listen to the word, yes. But there's a disruption here, and that's how I feel, okay? All right, spirit. Let's get two cards to start off. 
Aries reading, please, because I have to close out your reading. I have to move on. I have three more readings after you guys. Okay, two of wands. I'm sorry, this deck was reversed. Two of wands, look at this, stuck energy. So there's some type of planning taking place here, choices. Something hasn't been fully closed out yet, okay? Yes, some of you guys are changing up your social media as well, or you're plan to, planning to change up your social media or open up a social media. Uh, yes, some of you guys are planning planning to travel the world. Some of you guys, somebody may have chosen somebody over you. They thought the grass was greener. They finding out that the grass wasn't greener. <laughs> These motherfuckers finding out here. All right, but something fully hasn't been closed out yet. Okay, yeah, some of you guys are migrating to another country as well. There's a detachment with you, emotionally withdrawn. Um, yes, but you're torn between two paths. But right now, it's monitoring people, their actions. Um, yes, okay, but this is you focusing on yourself, your needs, your wants, okay? Yeah. Choices. Queen of Pentacles. Queen of Pentacles, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. Okay, there may be a businesswoman in your energy. Okay, yes. This could be a mother-in-law. This could be a landlord. Um, this could be your old mom as well. Somebody who's married, stable, secured. Uh, but let's see what's going on with this Queen of Pentacles. This could be a boss or somebody at work. Uh, business, business. But I see that you're focusing on your money, your coins, your stability. Okay? Being a good provider, being a good wife, husband. Yes, King of Cups. With the King of Cups here, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. There is a father figure here. Okay, now you may have children with this person, or this person has kids, or this could be your own dad. Um, or this could be a friend of yours, a brother, a brother-in-law, but let's see. Um, somebody may still be in love with you here, or have feelings for you. Yeah, Four of Cups. I see some type of rejection going on here. Um, yes, depression as well. Focusing too much on the negativity. There's a lot of nostalgia going on here. All right. But Spirit wants you to meditate during this time. You feel like you missed opportunities here. Yes. Nine of Wands. You're not giving up the fight, though. You feel like this is an ongoing battle here as well. Okay. But you guys are close to success. Close to success. But you just feel drained. You feel like, when is this going to end? But you still stand your ground. Protect yourself. Okay. Yes, six of cups. A lot of nostalgia about the past, reminiscing about the past, childhood. Yes. Okay. There's somebody from your past reemerging as well. Okay, some of you guys may have been through a lot in your past during childhood. I see a soulmate coming in, a past life love, or there's somebody from your past. It could be sisters, brothers, cousins, uncles. But let's see here. This could be your own children. Children, some of you guys may have a lot of kids out there. Yes, Queen of Wands. Here we go. Now, with the Queen of Wands here, this is another person, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. This person may have a lot of kids. Not necessarily. This person is single, but this is your energy. But there may have been another woman involved in this situation here. All right? Somebody may have fathered a child outside of a marriage. That's for some of you guys. All right? But I see that you guys are single. You're looking good. You're all about business generous you have a good business sense as well but you're leading you're taking the lead um but you're intuitive as well follow your intuitions but let's see here yes king of pentacles here we go and then we have the king of pentacles per king queen of pentacles perfect match so there is a king of pentacles coming out here this is a business person this is somebody possibly married uh stable reliable grounded here uh that's in your energy so let's see Two men, two women. Yes, Knight of Cups. This person has feelings for you. The thought of love of you feels good to them. But they know they're in love with you. Somebody's in love with you here. But this person possibly has responsibilities. Children are involved here. And again, this may be same-sex relationship. Um, not necessarily, but it can be. All right, but somebody obligations are to their children, but they're in love with you, but they're in a marriage here. They may be kid again, somebody may be pregnant here or had pregnant or pregnancy on the outside, but with the Knight of Cups, there's somebody here that, that, that's in love with you and they want to express this. They're coming in. Crisis Cancer Scorpio. Yes, Ten of Pentacles. Wow. 
Okay, so some of you guys may have may be single out there, but have your own business, have your own house and inheritance. Um, but this person has a lot of money. Whoever's coming in, or they 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 have a business with this person. There's some type of children, business, and property involved in this, or an inheritance of some sort. All right, but somebody wants to settle down with you. Somebody feels like they could build their legacy with you. Um, yes, they want to offer you long term moving in as well. Yes, justice. Somebody may be going to court, but they want to be fair with you here. They want to bring balance to the situation. Like I said, they want your forgiveness, but you're going to get your karmic justice in terms of money. Okay? Yes, because, you know, some of you guys inherited something from your parents or a father, something here. All right? But I do see settlements, an apology coming your way, but some type of legal actions here. But let's see. Libra. Yes, Seven of Swords. Here we go. Somebody's being deceptive here. Um, yes. Okay. So somebody's not being totally honest here in a situation. So let's see what this is about. Yes, Three of Cups. Somebody was carrying on a third-party situation. This could be friends, family, people that you hang out with. Yes, this could be a child involved in this situation, but something came to light about three is a crowd. So many, too many people involved in this situation. Leo. Yes, Five of Wands. Fights, arguments, conflict, um, competition going on here. A clash of egos. Leo. Cancer. Yes, Queen of Wands. Yes, a Queen of Wands again came out. Okay, yes, because there may have been somebody else on the side or somebody doesn't want somebody to be with somebody else here. I see you stand your ground. Yes, because somebody has a family here, but somebody finds you to be their true love. Somebody's ending something here. Okay, you possibly ended this. Um, finding out somebody passed away. Somebody's a widow here, but somebody, I see blockages, ghosting going on here. Leaving somebody out in the cold here. But, um, yes, there's a family involved here. A family doesn't approve of this connection. This could be your family as well that you're not getting along with. Yes, Nine of Wands. Okay, yes, with the Nine of Wands, you're not giving up. You're not giving up, but you're protecting yourself. You're standing your ground here. Yes, King of Swords. Okay, yeah, I see somebody being totally honest here. Somebody was possibly cold attached, but I see somebody wants to speak some type of truth here. Uh, somebody's cutting out a family here. Legal issues. Yes, yeah, it's over money, property. There's a judgment being made here. Possibly children are involved as well. King of Wands, somebody feels like you're the perfect match. King, Queen of Wands, they feel like you're the perfect match, but they're selling something out in court with a family with, in terms of money, children, and somebody possibly found out about a third party, and that's coming to light too. But I see somebody having serious talk here and cutting, you know, making the necessary steps to cut somebody boot somebody out here because both of them possibly was cheating on each other, or this was, you know, a marriage made of out of an illusion here. It could be property owner as well, business people, but yeah. Yes, five of cups, missing, longing, remorse, regret, disappointment, sadness, Scorpio. Will of Fortune, destiny is at play here. Okay, karma is being wrapped up for these people. Somebody's got about to get their shit rocked. Yeah, Eight of Swords, stuck energy here. A stuck energy. Somebody is stuck on you or you stuck on them. Or they may be stuck in a situation, contracts, um, or in a family. Or you are. Okay, but, or somebody may be locked up. Or you are. But there's a stuck energy here. Overthinking a situation, can't move forward. Okay, yes, Ace of Pentacles. Yes, somebody wants to bind your money, or again, somebody's buying it here when it comes to money here, but somebody wants to come in to make you a big offer here. I see a, a proposition in terms of promotion, a new job, um, but somebody's money may be tied up, like joint account or um, in a family business that they're trying to break free from, a contract of some sort. Um, but somebody wants to come into proposition, a big is a new beginning for you. Okay, yes, in terms of money. Somebody may be doing a lot of time in jail as well. Yeah. Yes, the Harris fan in reverse. Yes, yeah, somebody's getting out of a marriage here. Somebody's overly critical, bossy, judgmental here, a lack of spiritual support going on here. Yeah, but somebody was inconsistent here, but I see 
an unconventional relationship but somebody getting out of a marriage or out of a, a belief a set belief uh, so if somebody was religious they're becoming more spiritual here yes ace of wands and they want to send you a message but there's some type of paperwork and news that's coming your way here one more somebody wants new beginnings with you yes this, they're going to send you a message here yes that's the truth uh, and I see property moving in together, marriage. Somebody wants to propose to you here, but I see, wow, the lovers, yes. The truth came out about the lovers here, but somebody's still in love with you here, okay? And I see that they want to settle down with you, all right? They're going to send you a message to reunite, yes, ten of cups in the end. They find you to be their true family and happiness here, but they're trying to get themselves out of a contract here, or you are. Somebody's filing for bankruptcy as well, or somebody's doing a lot of time here, okay? Hold on. What a turn of events here. Yes, somebody's doing black magic. First card, boom. Yes, somebody's doing black magic. They're trying to manipulate the energy here. There's a lot of confusion going on here. You need to stay prayed up, guys. Okay, yes, sacral chakra. Work on your sacral chakra here. What I said, emotionally center yourself. This is about holding in a healthier relationship. Um, yes, remaining abstinent here. But again, somebody may be doing sex magic. But these are people. These are group of people doing this shit to you. Okay? Yes. I'll get the spiritual wolf here after this. Neptune, follow your intuitions. They're trying to block your third eye here. Somebody's trying to manipulate your energy. You have psychic abilities here. Okay, yes, throat chakra. Uh, some There's communication coming in. Some of you guys are already public speakers as well, but you're speaking up. You're being honest here. Yes, okay. Yes, light worker. Yes, some of you guys are light workers out there um, doing the healing work or being called to be a light worker. Okay, S strong manifester out there, inner child. Yeah, so somebody's still healing from the past, like I said. Okay, yes. A lot of repressed feelings, feeling lost here, root chakra, grounded, sta stability, stabilizing yourself, feeling secure, listen to your instincts, follow your intuitions here, focus, stay focused and present, guys, yes, watching, okay, so somebody wants to talk, they don't, they're tired of watching you, they want to come in and communicate now, they're feeling restricted, they're fear of rejection here, they're feeling guilty, somebody's about to reach out to you here, dark night of the soul, yes, you're feeling trapped, this is dark night of the soul here, they want to leave you bounded here, okay? Yes, you're feeling crazy, lack of energy, Mars, Aries, Scorpio, but there's a fiery, passionate new beginning for you guys, and moving, yes, you guys are moving here, but some of you guys are suffering, there is, here goes the Queen of Earth, and there's a Cancer involved in this situation here, um, I see, uh, again, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, uh, yes, but you're definitely, your money is coming in, you may be dealing with an Aquarius as well, but there is definitely somebody in the mix here manipulating the energy, Okay, yes, queen of fire, somebody who's argumentative, somebody who's comp competitive, uh, somebody who's catty, okay, somebody who sleeps around, unfaithful, yes, there's a divine union coming in, being divinely guided to you, like I said, but you're in spiritual solitude, this may be a Libra, but you're going to be breaking generational curses as well, yes, the floodgates are opening, your money is definitely coming in, what a turn of events, okay, what a turn of events here. So whoever's doing this, uh, 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 back at you. It's being reversed anyway because you're moving. You're moving. And I did see a place. Okay? Hold on. Your guardian angels are protecting you anyway, so they can't do anything with you. But they're, pay attention to your dream. Astral traveling, angel numbers, signs and symbols. They're trying to show you here. Be careful with food and drinks, cutlery. Be careful with any dinners, what people give to you. But there's a lot of people involved in this. And, they, and again, it could be family and friends. It doesn't have to be a relationship. Okay? A mother is standing out here. But a mother figure here is, 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 is in, the, in the mix here. Yes, this is this the Dark Lord. Okay? These are, these are people who go to church. Some of them go to church here. But, you know, they're... <laughs> They're studying some dark shit. Window. They open a portal here. Okay? Yes. It's a passion way to your soul, thoughts, intentions. Yeah, but Akashic Records. But a gateway portal or passageway into something leads the way to your soul, thoughts, intentions, etc. Must be protected from intruders. Yes. So you may be getting dark dreams. Okay? Yes. Food dreams. Eating in your dream. Dogs attacking you. Well, animals attacking you. But uh, Kashyyyk Records, you have the power to see the past, present, and future. But they're trying to block your intuitions here. Yes. They're, they're sending intentions your way. Like I said, 
Yes, travel. You're actually traveling, so pay attention. Okay, you're, you're experiencing an out-of-body experience. Spirit is going to show you who these people are. You may be into some type of crystal work as well. This is like healing energy. Yes, spades. Okay. Yes, death and destruction bringers that come in and lie about their true intentions. They thrive off of illusions and fooling their victims. So be careful with this. Be careful. Realm jumper. Shifting your reality through quantum jumping, making big and effortless changes towards a life with greater harmony and prosperity. Yes, this could be at your workplace. Like I said, it's a group of them. It's a group of them working on this. Co-workers, they went to a Babylon or somebody's the ringleader here. A warlock. Yes. Fake guru in reverse, which means that this person been practicing this, this for a very long time. They know what they're doing here. They want to leave you in an illusion here as well. Mind manipulation taking place here. Yes, they're gang stalking you. This is Judas's, but upside down. This is going to be reversed right back on them. They're trying to shatter your mind here. They're doing background checks. Your ancestors are protecting you from these spiritual attacks here. Yes, one more. Alcohol, what I said. They want to leave you drinking. Smoking, drugs, addicted to something here, but be careful with drinks and who pull your drinks. Yes, this dark energy, dark forces are trying to block your gifts, but you feel the energy. You feel that something is not right here. Okay, they want to they want to steal your spiritual light. They want to steal your, your gifts. They cannot. They cannot. They, they're trying to steal your destiny here. They cannot. What's meant for you is meant for you. Okay, the fuck is wrong with people? Because I see you guys doing some big shit out there. Your money is definitely coming in. But they're trying to block this shit. Okay? So you may be feeling like, wow, where's my money? My money's not picking up here. I'm putting in the work. Or feeling lazy, lethargic. Yes. The fuck is wrong with people? Let's end this. The end. Book. Educate yourself. Develop your spiritual gifts. But these are people that's learning, doing doing some type of kitchen magic for some of them. Yes. Ups and downs. That's how you feel. And that's how I was feeling. Ups and downs. Ups and downs. Your work has potential for both advancement and stagnation. See if there's hope, but allow yourself to move on if needed. Yes, they want to leave you in a circle. Round and around. One minute you move forward, one step forward, ten steps back. But you're protected. Yes, they want to trap you. I can't make this up. I can't make this up. They want to trap you. Okay, they want to shatter your mind, steal your, your, your spiritual gifts. They cannot. Keep developing them. You feel stuck in your current situation, but you do have options. We got your options. Look for another job while keeping the one you have for now. So look look for another job or work on things in silence. Celery, detached, unwelcome, change, bitterness. Grudges may suffer from high blood pressure. Check your blood pressure. Some of you guys may like to drink celery water or something, but celery is a, a good antioxidant. Yes, peas, gratitude, adversity, resilience, and patience. You're going to overcome this, okay? You're going to overcome this. But show gratitude each and every day. When you wake up in the morning, show gratitude. Thank you, God, for life. Thank you for my health. Thank you for my home. Thank you for food. Even you have to thank the smallest things. You got to thank. You got to be thankful. And turn up, exhausted, disappointments, health concerns, and legal issues. Yes. Mm -hmm. Time. Powerful ancestors, underdog. Oh. Powerful ancestors, undercover boss, modest, hard to get, and may suffer from insomnia. What I said. So you have powerful ancestors. Keep keep running your race. Keep going. Keep going. Don't give up. Let me get one of these, and I'm done with your reading. Oh, well, no. Letting go. In reverse. You see this? First, letting go was upright, but somebody can't release. Somebody's not finished with you yet. They're not finished. You're done. 
but they're not done with you yet. But you let go. But they they they, they want a stronghold on you. They want to shatter you here. What the fuck is going on? Oh, I gotta pick an angel for you. And stop what I said. <laughs> Listen to your girl Tosh. Listen to me. I know what the fuck I'm talking. I sage everything. My energy feels good. My head, my head is not. But this is how they want to leave you. You guys nah, definitely need, need to take your spiritual bath. But holding on to resentment, holding on to the past is not allowing you to move forward. You need to forgive, let go. That's what they want. The enemy wants to leave you stuck here. No, forgive it, let go. Addictions, let it go. Alcohol, any temptations, let it go. Release it. Alignment. Your body is requiring energy work to get back in alignment by balancing ba your outer alignment, by balancing your chakras and clearing your auric field. You have stuck energy that can be caused by holding onto pain or have a resistance to let new energy flow in. Get grounded and reconnected to your body once again. But somebody, somebody here is manipulating your energy. Somebody here is manipulating it. Let me get an angel and I'm closing out your reading. Here it is. Asmodel, Asmodel, Asmodel. So planning, patience, okay? Some of you guys may have rising moon, Venus, or your North Node in Taurus, or be dealing with a Taurus 33. Look up the angel number 33, or you may, you may be seeing a lot of 3336. Three, three, is all about intuitions, family matters, compromising, uh, bringing harmony and peace in a relationship or with people. Okay, so again, some of you guys are going to court, legal matters, or working the law, or the law field. But I see things being illuminated here. Study, do your research. Some of you guys may have a lot of books or need to get books or work in the library. But I do see justice. But coming up with a new plan, work in silence, work in silence. But there is a message coming. Okay, Asmodel, angel of patience. Patience is required here. But stay prayed up at this time. Do your spiritual work. Read your, read your spiritual book. Get enlightened. Okay, inner peace. Inner peace. Next best, next best step. So coming up again, they want you to give up. Trial and error in reverse. They want you to give up on your ideas. Give up. But spirit is saying no. You need to plan for your next best step. We got you. Develop plans. Exactly. Develop new plans. Attention to detail. Pay attention to the details. Okay. Cautious. Cautious with people and who you share your ideas with. Share with nobody. Trust nobody. Can't trust anybody. <laughs> unruffled but remain unbothered remain unbothered okay i help time patience and planning be your allies when you contend with annoying details or complex situations watermelon termaline april you were born in april so aries taurus so you are at the cusp and wait so just wait for it so yes yeah, so something coming up next year but i see physical health so getting into shape yes but prepare so start preparing now okay because before you know it april is here um, but this is all I have for you, um, Aries. I have to go now. This is this is very this is this is this is something else. This is something else. But um, yes, there are people manipulating your energy. You need to stay prayed up. One step forward, ten steps back. That's how they want to leave you. They want to leave you stuck. Okay, but you're going. You, they're protecting you. But you need to you need to you need to meet God halfway. Okay, so it's time for you to meet your spirit team halfway. Anyway, guys, I love you guys. I'm possible. You're possible. You're Tosh. I'm out.